Rob Armstrong has launched what he calls the Black Sharpie Revolt. After discovering that Dilbert, creator Scott Adams made racist remarks last week on YouTube. Armstrong is the creator of Jumpstart, the long-running syndicated comic strip and in-development CBS television project that centers on a black family in Philadelphia. For more than three decades, he has been a prominent voice of diversity on the comics page, even inspiring the last name of Franklin in Peanuts. Armstrong also once considered himself a friend of Adams, beginning not long after the two men were signed and launched by the same syndicate, the now defunct United Media, in the late 1980s. Adams even wrote a glowing blurb for a 2016 book written by Armstrong. So Armstrong originally thought it was a prank when a friend told him that Adams had said on his Real Coffee YouTube show Wednesday that the Dilbert creator was promoting segregation, telling white people to get the hell away from black people. My heart sank at first, then broke, Armstrong. I had to accept the reality that my friend from the early days was gone. In his place was a soulless, heartless racist. Armstrong turned to social media and urged readers who owned his 2016 book, Fearless, a cartoonist's guide to life, to cross out the Adams blurb, posting, use a thick black marker to stand up against racism. Adams's blurb calls the book, an inspiration, containing, some of the most insightful cartooning advice you will ever read. That campaign was among a series of strong and condemning reactions within the comics industry in recent days, after Adams's racist rant in response to a Rasmussen poll that found 26% of black Americans disagreed with the statement, it's okay to be white, compared with 12% of the GE. The Post's Philip Bump wrote that Rasmussen amplifies right-wing causes and rhetoric. The slogan in the poll is sometimes associated with racist memes, and the Anti-Defamation League has deemed it a hate symbol.